Hello and welcome! I would like to go over something really important when it comes to being a beginner and learning how to cut hair, and that is clippers. How to understand them and use them to get the best results on your haircuts. I will just be covering the wall clippers. These are the clippers that I have the most experience in using and I believe to be the easiest to use for a beginner. So we'll jump right in! So to start off, here are all of the clipper sizes that I ordered with my wall seniors. Something to keep in mind when ordering clippers like these is that the clipper guards are sold separately from the clippers. But these are by far my favorite that I have used. They are simple to understand and get results that I am happy with. So we have clipper guards from 1 to 8. The smaller the number, the shorter the results will be when using them. So if you're going to use a number 1 clipper guard, you will be getting a 1 eighth of an inch as an end result. With this clipper guard, you are going to be able to see the scalp. Then you can go all the way up to the longest, which is a number eight, and that is going to leave an inch of hair. That is a good thing to point out as well. The length that is in the left corner is the length that will be left, not the length that, will be, that you will be cutting. So if you use a number one clipper guard, the length that's left will be one eighth of an inch. So just to reiterate, you will not be cutting off one eighth of an inch. You will be left with one eighth of an inch. The same goes for all of the other clipper guards. The number that you see in the left hand corner is going to be the length that is left after you've used it. So those are the clipper guards. The next important thing to talk about is just the body of the clippers. So on the clippers, you are going to see on one of the sides is the taper lever. This lever is going to adjust the blade. There are three positions that you can put it in. Closed, halfway, and open. Closed is when the clipper's lever is all the way at the front of the clipper. This is going to give you the true length of the clipper guard that you are using. So if you were using a number one guard, and had the taper lever in the closed position, you will have a true one length, so one eighth of an inch. Halfway is when the lever is at the halfway point. This will be helpful to use when you are cutting in between lengths if you are going to do a fade. So in the halfway position with a number one clipper guard, you can easily blend between one to one and a half. Open is when the clipper's lever is all the way towards the back. This will add length to the guard that you are using. So if you are going to use a number one guard and put the taper lever in the open position, you will be getting a one and a half length. The actual length added will vary between clipper brands and clipper guards. Just keep this in mind that when the taper lever is in the halfway or open position, length will be added. Those are the things to keep in mind when you are using clippers and getting ready to purchase them. I hope this video is helpful to you as you begin your journey to cutting hair. Thanks for watching.